Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina returned to Dhaka after a three-day official visit to Zermani. Government is not indifferent to commodity prices, says Kabir. There is no control over the market, alleged Rizvi. At the central Shohid Midar altar is ready to pay homage, there is no security risk, said the DMP commissioner. Assalamu alaikum, welcome to my TV news. I'm Fozer Oshun with you in the newsroom today. We are watching the headlines and I'm going to the details. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has returned to Dhaka after a three day official visit to Zermani. The plane carrying the Prime Minister departed from Munich Airport at 9 10 pm local time on Sunday and landed at Hosrul Shazalan International Airport in Dhaka at 11 am today. The Prime Minister left Dhaka on February 15 to attend the Munich Security Conference. She went there on the invitation of the chairman of the Munich Security Conference. This is the Prime Minister's first official visit outside the country after winning the 12th National Assembly elections. Sheikh Hasina attended the opening ceremony of the Munich Security Conference during her stay in Germany. She also met with several world leaders. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina called upon expatriate Bangladeshis to give a befitting reply to all conspiracies against the country's prosperity by representing correct information. She said that some people do not want the progress of the country and the continuity of a democracy. The PM said this during an exchange of views with Avamalik leaders living in Europe and Munich. Zermani on Sunday afternoon, the Prime Minister said that after 1975, the best election has been held in the country. General Secretary of Avamali Gobadul Kader said that the government is not indifferent to commodity prices. Various institutions of the government are working in control. He said this at a briefing at the Avamali President's political office in Dhanmondi at noon. Obadul Kader said that although two countries talked about the past elections, the acceptance of Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina in the international arena is unparalleled. He was invited to a security conference in Germany because of his importance in international security. Senior Joint Secretary General of BNP Ruhul Kabir Rizvi said that the government has no control over the market due to the business syndicate of Avamalik. He said this in a press briefing at the party central office in Napoleon in the morning. Rizvi said Avamalik has lost its political character and has now become a weapon based party. Obadul Kader has become the inanimate substance of Avamalik. He works only on gestures. Rizvi said all the innovative ways of suppressing the position party with the music power of the state have continued for the last one and a half decades. Returning officer Moniruza Manta Lukdar has declared all the nomination papers valid after scrutinizing the nomination submitted for the 50 reserved women sets of the 12th National Parliament. This announcement was made in the morning after checking the presence of the candidates in the election building of Agargao. Moniruza Manta Lukdar said that even if no one's name is omitted in the election, anyone can apple against the valid nomination paper. The central Shohid Minar altar is ready to pay homage to the immortal language martyrs. President Mohammad Shahabuddin and Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina will pay tribute to language martyrs at midnight on Tuesday. DMP Commissioner Habibur Rahman visited the central Shohid Minar as that promises in the morning to see the overall security situation. He said four-level security measures have been taken in the surrounding area including Shohid Minar. DMP Commissioner said that there is no security risk. Police will take immediate action if law and order is broken. DMP Commissioner urged everyone to come to Shohid Minar by following discipline and maintaining tolerant behavior towards each other. 
three passengers of an auto rickshaw were killed after being hit by a truck in Kaliakoir of Gachipur. Two more passengers were injured in the incident. The accident happened on the Dhaka Tangal Highway in Kaliakoir Puzila in the morning. According to the Najur Highway Police Station, five people were injured when a cargo truck hit the back of a battery operated auto rickshaw in the Shutrapur area of the Dhaka Tangal Highway. Later, local people, fire service, and highway police rescued the injured and took them to Kaliakoir Puzila Health Complex, where the doctor declared three dead. We are about to enter the headlines once again. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina returned to Dhaka after a three-day official visit to Zermani. Government is not indifferent to commodity prices, says Kader. There is no control over the market, as the Rizvi. The central Shohid Minar altar is ready to pay homage. There is no security risk, said the DMP commissioner. That's all from our newsroom for now. Thanks for being with us. To join with my TV news online, visit YouTube slash my TV BT News. And to watch all our programs, visit YouTube slash my TV Bangla, Facebook slash my TV Bangla. Our next bulletin will be telecast in Bangla at 7.30 p.m. Don't forget to join with us. Till then, stay connected. Allah Hafiz.